Hey guys, what's up? We're going to be coming to you today and we're going to be doing something very cool. We are going to be using, as you see, my B-Heptic suit and the B-Heptic sleeves. And we're going to be doing step by step using this wirelessly, the Oculus Quest 2 with Blade and Sorcery, the game. It's just going to be a, a short video and uh, we're going to be doing step by step of how to set up the b -heptic suit using the Oculus Quest 2 wirelessly with the mod Blade and Sorcery. Hope you enjoy this. Alright, well this is how you do um, the setup of Blade and Sorcery with the b -heptics. Come over here. Alright. You'll come here and click on B-Heptics. Alright. Come down. Alright. Come down right here where it says uh, Blade and Sorceries Nexus Mod. So click on that. And you will uh, come here because you've got Game Link and all this other stuff. And right here is all the stuff that it will work with of all the B-Heptic gear. So you'll come over and press Mod. All right. And now then, you got this. All right. So what you will do, now, if you want to do this, you'll come uh, without the vortex. You can come over here and press the download button and press the download and then go to your game folder because mine is in East. Uh, Steam Games, Steam Apps, Common, and then Blade and Sorcery, and then uh, something, something in Blade and Sorcery's folder called Assets, and then you'll see the Mods folder, and then it will have the Tecla, tecla suit. Well, tec, I cannot pronounce this Behetic suit name, but it will have that in there and stuff. But this is how you'll do it with the Vortex version, because we're going to be using it with the Vortex. So you'll come over here, uh, click in Vortex. All right. Then you come over here and start download. All right. Open link. Okay. Continue because we've already downloaded it so what you would do is just come over here and just press install. b Hetix suit looks like it's installed now, so... All right. Okay, so all that's completely done. So now what we're going to do... Okay. All right, we're going to come into our game folder and to check and see if it's there. So, come to the game folder, go to E, Steam Games, Steam Maps, Common. Look to find Blade and Sorceries. All right, uh, come to Blade and Sorcery's data. That was it that I was trying to explain earlier. All right, and then come down here to go to Streaming Assets. All right, come to Mods. And right here, as you see, the suit, the b Haptics, is in there. So now you are ready to play Blade and Sorceries with the b Haptic suit. All right. So, and there you have the complete setup of b Haptic suit with the Oculus Quest 2 wirelessly. And the software we're going to be using is Live Mixed Reality Software. And I'm going to leave all the links down in the description down below. So we are going to dive right into just a, just a small gameplay to let y'all see that this does work. So we're going to dive right into Blade and Sorceries. Let's do this. 
Okay. But as you see, that I got my little knife in my hand. So we're using the software called Live. And like I said, I'll leave all the links down in the description down below. But we are going to dive right into this game. Enjoy. Oh wow, look at this, whoa, especially with the Aquas Quest too, that looks pretty cool. It just feels good being wireless. Wave one. think about blade and sorcery with the b heptic support with the suit and the sleeves well hey filling all the sword slashes and where you seen the women were coming at me all the soldiers and all just trying to team up on me and get me and like you seen people coming behind me and stuff and you know that is an awesome thing right there when you look behind you and all you, you don't see nobody there, right? But when they start finally coming behind you, when they hit you, and all you will feel that, you will feel that ump, and all, and then you will look back, okay, yeah, they're back there. And now that's pretty cool right there. And, um, but as you see me doing step by step of how to set up everything with the B-Heptic suit to blade and sorcery with the mod, from Nexus, you'll have to sign into an account to be able to get all this up and running. As you've seen, I was using Vortex and all. And Vortex, uh, if you don't know what that is, uh, there's many, many tutorials on YouTube of how to use Vortex. 
and all. But yeah, is this a little on the expensive side of bee haptics? Yes, but is it worth it? Absolutely. So if you're into that, if you got enough money and all, uh, get a bee haptic suit. You'll be in for a treat because <laughs> I really enjoy this. But if you really like this video, hit the like button. Dislike the video if you dislike the button. Uh, subscribe to my channel. Notify me on the bell. And, um, and just let my channel grow. If you want to see any games, if you want to see any games with me playing from with the Yao VR Chair Simulator, the Smell Vision, or Catwalk C, or the Bee Haptic Suit, just let me know down in the comments down below. Because I really am getting excited because my channel is growing slowly. And also keep hitting that subscribe button. Until next time, I will see you in the next one. Cheers.